Um, I think they're talking about the big scoreboard. I don't know. I it's just it's what Roberto does. It's his motif, if you will. Um, you know, in the update there, I mm-hmm. am I am I alone in this? I'm actually watching that game tonight. You're definitely not alone. Okay, in that like game. it's. I mean, there are a lot of people because the Wings game is obviously very important. No, and that's fine. But you you can watch multiple things. Do you know how many baseball games I have mixed in with Shawshank Redemption? <laughs> Okay, like you can watch multiple things. Hey, you sit there, get confused. You know, the, the manager comes out, and the next thing you know, Dufresne's coming in from the bullpen. I mean, that that's what happens sometimes. Or a simulation of most of the Tiger at bats. It's yeah, Dufresne crawling yes, out of the pipe. Exactly. But tonight, you're right. LSU Iowa is must see TV, and it's a rivalry. Yes. I mean, it's Angel Reese, it's Caitlin Clark, right. and honestly, Kim Mulkey's a complete psycho. So, like, I know. I'm in. I need to see Kim Mulkey. Glitter blazer, maybe holding a folding chair and hitting somebody. Like, I'm in. I will watch this tonight, and I don't find women's basketball particularly entertaining because it's played below the rim, and I'm Correct. so conditioned to the men's game. Correct. That doesn't mean they're not skilled. Oh, they're, they're incredibly skilled. Yes, they're great but shooters. it's very hard for me to watch. But tonight, based on last year where Angel Reese did the whole John Cena routine, right. put the ring on it. Caitlin Clark, I get tired of having to hear about her, but fine. Here it is. Biggest stage. You got aced out by this team last year. Plus, you got the backdrop of Kim Mulkey going after newspapers left and right. By the way, rightfully so. These (laughs) newspapers are crap. But my point is, I mean, honestly, this whole, oh, Kim Mulkey's dad. It's like, that's the article? Come well, on, it was just It was a profile piece of her life, and so she didn't like it when because she didn't talk to them, all the quotes were actually from her, from her own book. So she well, should have been pissed. that's the problem with writing a book, isn't it? Yes, exactly. Uh, <laughs> she shouldn't have been pissed. But tonight, it's compelling. Okay, so if you are a per- like like me, I have not watched, well, I've, I've watched a piece or two. Like, I, I did see the, the Cardoza Angel Reese showdown and watch pieces yeah. of that. I've seen the highlights of a girl for Iowa State who's the, the center uh audie cooks or whatever her name is and she put up like 50 points right. and you're like how the hell but like i will actually tune into this a little bit tonight just because oh, yes. i'm so disenfranchised like the nba right now first of all forget about the piss yeah i'm a celtics fan i don't tune in on a nightly basis it's it's a bad product alert me when the playoffs start baseball yes however 159 games to go for the Tigers. Right. I got time. This is for a trip to the Final Four tonight. This will be wings depending on how they're playing. Yeah. And I will actually attempt to watch a little bit of the Caitlin Clark, Angel Reese yes. throwdown. And believe it or not, and I can't believe I'm saying, the second game is going to be interesting too, uh, USC against UConn. What is that girl's name for USC? Yeah, Juju, Juju Watkins. 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 Yes. Yeah. Our, our, and she has the potential. She won't score as many points probably as Caitlin Clark in her career, but she is could be. The, she'll take double the, the, the shots the, though. Yes, yeah, the best all around player. But like, is the average fan in Detroit going to flip this game on tonight? I think so. Two four eight five three nine ninety seven ninety seven. Are you watching tonight? Caitlin Clark versus Angel Reese, or okay. So we don't want to like spotlight players. Yeah. LSU versus Iowa. Why can't you spotlight I, the players? It's the only reason I'm tuning in. I know people don't like that. So for some reason, well, too bad. I know. Okay, so the defending champs against Iowa, Wings Lightning, or Tigers Mets. Why can't it be all of it? Well, some people only have one TV. Now it's I called go, a remote control. I, I, I know. That's what I'm going to do. And if you cut the cord, it's your problem. It's not yes. my fault. You're going to have a pinwheel rolling around when you try to right. turn the channel. Although some people say the UT. YouTube TV is the best because you can watch like six games at once. Multiple, yeah, but, yes. Yeah, but then you're asking for a seizure. You can't do that. All <laughs> these people, oh, how many TVs in your man cave? It's like, dude, if you have six TVs, you have zero. Right. You cannot focus on six college football games. It's no, not I, possible. I know. I, I get it. You're going to have a seizure. The EMS are going to be over. It's going to be a disaster. I, I get it. Two but, four eight five three nine ninety seven ninety seven. David, are you watching this tonight? Yeah, I was already planning to watch tonight. I love the women's game. It's so much better than the men's right now. So, yes, I am watching tonight. Are you doing one of these ESPN first take routines, or do you mean this? No, I'm serious. I've been watching the women's basketball games for a long time, even more now. that There's names here with Caitlin Clark and Juju Watkins. Okay, since it is below the rim, is it because of the, the fundamentals they pass the ball? What is it? 
It's just they have names. There are no names in the men's game right now. There's not many. That, that's a valid point. So there are names, and they're good. They're yeah, they actually are, again, really good. The only good. reason we know Edie, he's been there since 1993. Correct. And it's, I, I don't think it's, you know, I, I love this whole thing, too, where they're like, well, he's hard to officiate like Shaq. Shaq was, the, was a one-of-one. One. He was the greatest modern center to be born. He was designed in a let, not fat Shaq the late years, not no. the big leprechaun no. in Boston. Not your, yeah, I was going to say, you're Celtic. Not the, the Shaqaliers. Shaq proper at LSU and with the magic. No, no. Yes. Unbelievable athlete. Dude, Zach Eady, I God love him, and he's not a bad kid. No. I don't have a bad thing to say about him. He's like what he said about Rick Barnes. But he ain't great. He said, you know, I, I wanted to go to play. He didn't want me. He didn't even look at me. None of us did. I know. Besides, we all know that Purdue did some blood oath with Satan to always have a seven-footer. Now they got a ginger <laughs> one coming in next year. They got a redheaded Eady next year. After they had already had Ivan Drago. Oh, what right. was that kid's yes, name? Yes, I know. Uh <laughs> And then they, I, know exactly they, they just, I can't take it. They've had seven footers. Yeah. Then for they, had 20 the, years. they had the one kid who got injured what, at, L, at LCA one year, like he broke his arm. LCA during during the NCAA tournament one year. Not Spencer Haas. It might have been him. You talking the seven footer before him? Yeah, I don't know. Let me go look. The, well, the whole, whatever. Yeah. The point I'm making yeah, I know. You is, I know. it's not fair. Zach Eady can't be mad at any of us. He no. was born to go to Purdue. It's right. all they have. Right. They, they build spaceships. They have a sweatpants wearing mascot and they have seven footers. But I thought it was, you know, but what I like about him is more off the floor than on the floor. Did you see when they, they cut the net down? First of all, he didn't he need a ladder. There. He didn't need a ladder. Yeah. But he gave Gene Katie a part of it. Well, I, I that like was pretty that. Cool. I, listen, I like that. Yeah. And I miss the characters of college basketball. Here we go. I sound like I Clint Eastwood and Grant Torino oh, again. Gene Katie, the greatest. Come Get over. Off my lawn. I, I miss the c celebrity coaches. I miss them. The Big East. That's all it's it why I so desperately wanted Rick Patino back. Yeah. I wanted a playing game in Dayton. Izzo's leisure wear versus Patino's white suit. <laughs> There's no coaches I care about anymore. I know. None. 248-539-9797. Take a text, David. Uh, no channel or the same. Sorry, no chance I'm watching the women's hoops, wings, and tigers tonight. Okay. Someone else says, I might watch it for a second, but that's about it. Uh, you usually can't hold my attention that long. And I agree with that. That's why I'm mixing it in. But if there was one game, if you ever wanted me to watch one women's basketball game, it would be tonight because of a pre-existing rivalry. The fact that Angel Reese had to come out and go, believe it or not, we don't hate each other, right. which is code for we do. And then you have an insane coach in a glitter pants suit that's going to be so doing something insane. I, I'll just, I got to tune in for a little bit. There are a lot of characters in this woman. Dawn Staley, she's a great coach, but she she goes at it a lot, well, too. And the team's also like 40 and all. <laughs> I know. And Cardoza, the, the Brazilian center they got, is absolutely just, she, she kills people. I know. So, no, I, I, I will watch. Can I tell you I'll be glued to it? No. All right, more importantly, what's the line? I, Did you do it on Cash no, the Ticket? No, no, no. Oh, come no, on. No, Stoney. I know the line because I, I saw it on ESPN earlier. Okay. So I'm not telling you from, I would have no idea what to do or where the money is. You're it's sure. Iowa minus one and a half. Okay. No, we're not doing, no, we're not doing this. I'm not <laughs> doing this with you. I, 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 Mike, I don't. I don't know how to bet women's hoops. I don't know what's important, what's not. Please. But you know people who do. Who? I don't know. I don't know anyone who bets women's basketball. I think, come on, you're Mr. Cash the Ticket. You, no. have to have, you must have a women's basketball insider somewhere. No, I do not. I would take do you LSU. Want, do you want, hey, congrats, you're, you're hired. <laughs> LSU with the money line is what I would take. They're not gonna. They're not losing to Iowa. Not losing. Okay, what do you want me to argue? Uh, <laughs> we'll get to the callers next. Uh, all right. <laughs> Yeah, David, what I do you like want me to that, say? L that LSU money line and USC. What's the line? You know what? I'm just going to start half. reading. Three yeah.